Hey Aries and welcome. My name is Inez and today I'll be doing your weekly reading from September 22nd to the 28th. Okay, now I want you to please keep in mind that these are general love readings and they cannot and will not resonate with all of you. So if it doesn't apply to you, then let it fly. If it does apply, then I would love to read your comments down below. Also, I would like to let you know that right now I'm offering a free 15 minute phone reading, but first you must subscribe before you get it. And also, if you're interested in getting the phone reading, the personal reading, you can contact me at my email address, which is intimategoddesstarot at gmail.com. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Now, with that being said, let's get your reading started. I already shuffled these cards off camera for the sake of time, but I'll shuffle them one more time for you, okay? Here we go. Aries in love from September 22nd, the 28th, 2018. I mean, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Aries. Aries in love. Okay, so the Wheel of Fortune just flew out. Okay, so it's within your time. The wheel's turning within your time. Let's find out, Aries. Let's get a look. Divine timing right there. Aries, Aries, and Aries. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love from September 22nd to the 28th, 2019. Please tell me about Aries in love. Okay, Aries, here we go. And at the bottom of the deck, we got the Hermit. And we have the Nine of Cups, so somebody's overindulging here. The Emperor and the Devil. What are you doing, Aries? Are we having way too much fun here? Because these two together, it's not really a good combination, depending on how you're using it. I mean, because... You do have some alcohol, and then you got some desire, lust, and pleasure. We got desire, lust, passion, and then we got some alcohol. Are you trying to blame it on the alcohol? Huh? Blame it, blame, blame it on the alcohol? What's how the song goes again? Just blame it on the alcohol? And then we got the emperor here. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Capricorn here. So it looks like someone is overindulging. This could be a toxic situation. It doesn't have to be at all. It really doesn't have to be. It could just be where you having way too much fun here. I mean, this could be a lot of fun, though. You really think about it. You know, the lust, passion, the desire, and the alcohol. That's a lot of fun. But then you got this this uh, emperor here that's being all stubborn about it. It's like, what the hell are you all being all stubborn about? What's up with your ego? Did somebody bust your ego? Did somebody kill your ego, tell you something you didn't want to hear? Hmm? Well... Yeah, somebody's overindulging here. It could be a toxic situation. It doesn't have to be. And I feel that somebody here is being very stubborn. Is being someone here is very stubborn and they're turning to and they could be overindulging in alcohol. Uh, they could turn into a workaholic. It could be shopping, uh, uh, substance abuse illegal substance 
and you know it could be that it could be alcohol and they could be doing something i mean they could be that's what it looks like that the person could be doing it turning someone's turning to the alcohol for pleasure well not alcohol well might be because i just said alcohol so somebody might just be turning to the alcohol for pleasure Please give me more information on the Nine of Cups. Please give me more information on this Nine of Cups. You're not communicating with somebody, right? Yeah. Because the Four of Swords just came out and... Well, it came out kind of sideways. And once it, it came out like this. So either you're communicating with somebody and either you're not communicating with somebody and you're doing some self-reflecting and or you are communicating with them because it came out kind of sideways please give more information on the nine of cups why is the nine of cups here please give more information on this nine of cups why is the nine of cups here please give more information on this nine of cups it's someone that you love please give more information on this nine of cups nine of cups wow so it looks like Somebody walked away, but they're coming back. But this was, they walked, they left choppy waters. Because look, we got the two of cups here. And then the eight of cups in reverse, so they're coming back. Whoever walked away is coming back now. And then we got the six of swords. So they're coming back. Whoever this person is, they're coming back. And you guys could be communicating right about now. You guys could be communicating. This person is definitely coming back. You got the Eight of Cups and the Six of, and the six of Swords in reverse. And both cards are you leaving. Is a person actually leaving, but they both came out in reverse. So someone is coming back. And I could see, now I understand the Nine of Cups and the Devil. You little devil. You little devil. Look at what you're going to be doing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't blame it on that alcohol, right? Yeah, okay. We all used that excuse before. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you guys uh, you guys could be uh, communicating. Because remember, the four swords came out kind of sideways. So you guys, either you guys are not communicating. And this person hasn't came back yet. But once it's pro bowl, but if you are communicating, this person, this is when the person will start coming back. So this could have happened or hasn't happened or will happen. Somewhere in between there. Somewhere in between there. You already know what I mean. But this person, you guys love each other. There's love here and that's the reason why. And this person is emotionally fulfilling for you. You fulfill this person emotionally and they fulfill you emotionally. And there's love here and that's why they're coming back. At one point, you guys probably wasn't communicating at all. Someone was doing some self-reflecting. But now, you came out of that, and now you guys are starting to communicate, and now this person's coming back. Good for you, Aries. Yeah. I can see why. I'm waiting for the Three of Cups to come out to celebrate. So we can be celebrating, right? I mean, we got the passion, the lust, and desire here. I'm telling you. This devil, this is a good little devil right here. He ain't bad. He ain't no bad little devil. I sure ain't seen him like that. Whoever does, and that's on your eyes and your eyes only. <laughs> Please get more information on this emperor. Why is this emperor here? Look at that. I told you, didn't I say about the three of cups? <laughs> the three of cups just came out. But it came out in reverse. So there could have been a three-party celebration. I mean, celebration. <laughs> Not that kind of party. <laughs> Not that kind of party, Aries. Right, Aries? We're not having that kind of party. <laughs> hey, ain't that kind of party, right? It's not that kind of party. <laughs> <laughs> no so it could have been a three party situation and this person is no longer in it because it came out in reverse 
okay? <laughs> Okay, please give me more information on this emperor. Please give me more information on this emperor. Why is this emperor here? Please give me more information on this emperor. Why is this emperor here? Please give me more information on this emperor. Why is this emperor here? Please give me more information on this emperor. Please give me more information. Okay, let's see. Yeah. So, we have the Seven of Cups in reverse. And remember, we had the Three of Cups in reverse. And then we also got the Four of Cups. So, this person right here, at one point, they had options. Not anymore. You ain't got no more options. Mm -mm. You out of that three-party situation, and there's no options. So that means that they already narrowed it down to what they want. There's no more options. They're no, or they know, or better yet, they're just not confused anymore. Because they could have been confused at one point, and that's where, and that's where. Remember, at the bottom of the deck, we had the hermit, and the hermit. You go within and search up answers, and then right here. With the four of swords, the four of swords is you uh, doing some self-reflecting. That's, you know, both of these, both cards have to do with in search of, you know, in search of answers. And not communicating with a person. So, that's what's going on here. You could have either, you could have either been confused and you needed to go within in search of answers. And now... You already know what it is. You're no longer confused. You know what you want. You don't want to be in this three-party situation. You know who you want. And the person that you want is the one that you're in love with. The one that left. Either you or them, because this could go vice versa. So the one that left, that's the one that you want, because that's the one that emotionally fulfills you. And the seven of, ooh, the seven, the four of cups here. You don't want to miss out on this opportunity. You don't want to. You don't want to miss out on that opportunity. So either you was confused, but now you know. You was confused and you and you had options and you dropped the three party option. Three party situation. You drop it. Let's see about this little devil. Let's see what's going on. I don't know about this devil right here. Let's see. Please give me more information on this devil. Why is this devil here? Please give me more information on the devil. Please give me more information on the devil. Why is this devil here? Oops. Please give me more information on this devil. Do you have more information on this devil? Do you have more information on this devil? Why is the devil here? Aries, you was heartbroken. Oh, actually, no. The three-party situation. Because we got the three of swords. Do you have more information on this devil? That flew out. That, that didn't count. Do you have more information on this devil? Devil. Please give me more information on this devil. Why is this devil here? Yeah, you could have been dealing with an earth sign of the Virgo, a Virgo Capricorn, or a Taurus. Please give me more information on this uh, devil. Or you could be dealing with an air sign, Aquarius, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Can't get the words out. Okay, this is not talking. So, so far, we got the King of Swords, the Nine of Pentacles, and what's the other card? The Three of Swords. So, this was a three-party situation. That's what this was. Three-party situation. Who came out first? And 
It was a three-party situation here, and it was toxic. Yes, it was. It was a toxic situation. You have an air sign with an earth sign here. And the three-party could have went on. You was probably having an affair with them. And... But it's not what you wanted, though. That's why you let it go. It's not what you wanted. Because this was just an affair. It was in, It was just... It, it, didn't, it didn't mean much to you. It didn't mean much, much to you. I mean, I'm sorry, but it's the truth. That's what I'm saying. It was just passion. It was just sexual. That's all it was. You was having a sexual affair. Most likely, I mean, if you was, it doesn't have to be the signs. It could be a different sign. But here with the devil, you was having a sexual affair with an earth sign or an air sign. And this was a three-party situation. And this person found out about it. And that's why they ended up leaving. Because, and then you find yourself with all these options, but then you get out of the third party situation because you no longer want that. You want your, you want the person that fulfills you, that emotionally fulfills you and makes you happy. That's the one you want to be with. That's the person you want to be with. Let's get some more information on this devil. Please give me more information on this devil. Why is the devil here? Please give me more information on this devil. Give me more information on this devil. Why is the devil here? Give me more information on the devil. You got an ace of wands here. It was passionate. Very passionate. That's for sure. Look. It was passionate. And you felt very passionate with this person, towards this person. And I think this story is from, I think it's coming in backwards to tell you the truth. Yeah, because when I look at, well, now that I'm looking at it, it looks like it's backwards. Yeah. I think this thing is, uh, yeah, it's, it's, they gave me the information backwards. So, what it looks like here, you was in a, a third-party situation. You could have been. Well, this, like I said, this is not going to apply to everybody. So, you could have been in a third-party situation. And you was probably dealing with an air sign or earth sign. And you felt very passionate towards this person. You, had, you felt passion, desire, lust. I mean, it was sexual. You felt very sexual towards this person. And then we had, because there's passion here. And you and someone here wanted a passionate new beginning. They wanted a passionate new beginning. But this was a three-party situation that was going on. And this person walked away. The person left. The th well, someone left the three-party situation. Someone left. Someone here had walked away. Either you or them walked away. And then, th and then someone here was confused because they didn't know what they wanted. But they did drop the three-party situation. That they dropped. They dropped the three-party situation because they wasn't being, because they wasn't emotionally fulfilled in the three-party situation. They was not emotionally fulfilled. And they didn't want to miss out on this opportunity. Someone here didn't want to miss out on the opportunity because they actually do love this person that they was with. Now, this three-party situation, this could have, it doesn't have to be another person. It could always be a family member. It could always be work that interferes. That is interfering because you have a very demanding job or they have a demanding job that requires a lot of their attention. It could be a family member that may be sick, that's constantly sick, and a person has to be taking care of them, or it could be, I mean, it could be anything. It could be a friend that's being that's all up in your business that don't need to be. It could always be that, and someone ended up walking away, and that left because that person was confused. So the three-party situation ended. It's no longer three-party, whether it was with another person or with a workplace 
the work was coming in between you guys because the person was working so much. That ended. So this person, they could have been confused at one point or they probably had options. But now they're no longer confused. They no longer have options and they don't want to miss out on the opportunity at all because they want this passion and new beginning with you, Aries. So Aries, this could be you or it could be the other person. And then they want this they want this new beginning with you because you emotionally fulfill them. You emotionally fulfill them and during that time frame that you guys were not communicating at all because you guys weren't communicating because the person left. They left. I mean because it's easy I mean come on now we got the eight of cups and the six of swords in reverse. So this person did. They left. This left psh, bye. And then we got the four uh, the four swords as well. So there was no communication, they left. That gave you time to do some self-reflecting. Right here, because we got the hermit that came out in the bottom of the deck. They gave you time to go within and search for the answers that you needed or that they needed. That gave them time to do it. And now this person has realized, or this person always knew, but just didn't want to admit it, that you actually fulfill them. You're, more, you're emotionally fulfilling to them. And they want to be with you. Because they do love you. Because there's love here. Because Pisces. I mean, I'm sorry. Did I call you Pisces? Yeah, I'm sorry. Aries. Aries. Aries, you do love this person. And they love you. Because we have the two of cups here. So there's love here. There's love. You do have emotions for this person. You do have feelings for this person. This person does make you feel happy. And you make them feel happy. So this person is coming back now because now they know that you're the one that they want. Now they know that you're the only person that they want to be with. Now they know that they only have eyes for you and you only. Okay, Aries? So this is good. I mean, it came out backwards. <laughs> but it's good. But it's good, though. It's a good thing. I told you that was a good little devil. See? It's a good level devil because now they're coming. And now you can have your two of cups with your alcohol and your little passion and desire. Blame it on the, blame it on the alcohol. <laughs> I forgot how the song goes, which I'm pretty sure you guys remember, though. Or oh, you will be remembering. <laughs> Go Aries. Okay, well, let's get you a love advice reading. Uh, please give me a love advice reading for Aries, Aries. Aries. Take charge. Uh, leadership and self-discipline are required to take control of your life. There you go, Aries. Can you see it? Yes, you can. Okay. So this is all I have for you. I will see you again next week. For your weekly readings and also don't forget to like share and subscribe okay bye aries